yeah, yeah, what up, what up, what up? It's the man of our town, Virgil Berry, a.k.a. Stacks with the Facts. And this is A Real Talk Podcast. I'm the CEO and founder of A Real Talk Media, based out of Columbus, Ohio. And I just want to say something real quick, because this has been on my soul and my conscience, so I got to speak on it. And I wanted to come to the YouTube street, because I've been telling y'all, we coming. We the new media. We can't trust the mainstream media no more. Me and others have been telling y'all this. Shouts out to my brethren, M. Rec. You know what I'm saying? Shouts out to Amina the Earth and the home M. Rec uh, mob. Shouts out to Red Supreme TV. Shouts out to Ose Duke Jackson, Kevin Samuels, Obsidian, Danica uh, Marie. You hear me? Love Dorsey. Everybody, man, I, people who I watch putting this content out and blazing y'all asses with this motherfucking heat. Minister Jack, you hear me? These are people I see myself collaborating with in the future. It stacks with the facts, man. My name is Virgil Berry, CEO and founder of A Real Talk Media LLC out of Columbus, Ohio, man. And I want to say a big, big shout out to my brethren, Kwame Brown. I don't know him. I'm not a big avid sports fan, but I remember him. And I want to give this man a salute for having the balls, the, the testicular fortitude to stand his ground, speak his truth, and put the fire to the asses of these motherfuckers. You hear me? I, it just rejuvenated my spirit. You hear what I'm saying? To hear and watch him cook these motherfuckers. You hear me? Give them your mama's cooking, brother. Hey, listen. And this ain't no clout chasing and shit, though. This real nigga shit right here. Cause of, you hear me? Content creators, y'all should be supporting the fuck out of Kwame Brown and what he doing right now. I've been saying this about the whole uh, sports industry to all my friends since we was kids. They pick niggas for this shit. This is the re-instituted... Re, uh, uh, reinvented slavery. Y'all hear my man talking that talk, man. That nigga made over a hundred million dollars. He ain't broke. He's sitting on 20, 30 acres. 40 years old, taking care of his family. Bought his mama a house before he was even old enough to buy a fucking pack of cigarettes, man. He ain't had that great of a career. Huh? Who's the say? He look like he's doing all right for himself to me. And he ain't stupid. He ain't woke. He's awake. He know what's going on. He ain't scared. And I love that, man. I absolutely love that. Kwame Brown, if you ever hear it, see this, bro. You got all my support, bro. You hear me? We ain't never got to meet up or talk. Listen here. I love seeing real men doing real shit. And exposing these fucking demons for the bitches they is. God damn it. Nigga, say what you gonna say. I love the way you say everything you saying, bro. Your mama's cooking. Cook they ass. You hear me? God damn it. Pretty boy. Mm, mm, mm. Charlemagne the Fraud. I've been telling y'all about this, nigga. If anybody who knows me follows me and what... Listen. My Facebook. Listen here. My Facebook. Oh, I've been telling y'all about Charlemagne the Fraud's ass. He ain't no fucking journalist, man. He don't ask no real questions. He don't hold nobody to no account. He's a yes man for the boule. I just wasn't aware that all of this was going on with Charlemagne the Fraud, though. Slash delinquency of minors. Creepy ass nigga. What type of nigga at 22 hanging around with 15-year-old little girls? I'm going to tell you right now. I'm an ex-D-boy from the streets. At 22, I wasn't met, man, listen. I wasn't messing with no 17-year-old girls at 22, man. Be honest with you, man. I got a daughter, man. Certain rules and codes in the street that certain men follow, man. And every male that's in the streets ain't a man. You got some dudes that's predators and can't wait to see a young 14, 15-year-old girl out there and take advantage of her. See, me and my homies, we don't get down like that. We ain't get down like that. Having a little broad. Uh, so, shots out to Kwame Brown, man. 
Oh man, this made me feel good, man. You hear me? Expose these bitches, man. Fuck these motherfuckers, man. Keep talking your talk, my nigga. Don't stop saying it just the way you saying it. You hear me? Don't change up nothing. This stack with the fact, man. www.arealtalkmedia.com. A Real Talk Podcast on YouTube. Subscribe, like, share, and comment. A R T M E D I A L L C at yahoo.com. That's Art Media LLC at yahoo.com. Get at me. Come on the podcast. Let's talk about it. I got a movie coming out too as well. This ain't no clout chasing. This is real recognizing real and real and real and real niggas that start linking up with each other. Fuck all that bullshit, man. All that fake ass, weak ass media, these motherfucking control cop chasing. Oh, I'm this nigga and you gotta get on my bandwagon and I fuck all that shit, man. Real recognizing real and real need to link up. You hear me? We the same age, brother. My homie Kwame Brown, if you happen to ever see this, we the same age. As a matter of fact, I'll be 40 in January, brother. I got a 12-year-old daughter. I'm poor and broke just as anybody else. They ain't about no money for me, man. If this is about some money for me, I will be taking advantage of a lot of you weak-minded people out here. And it's people like Kwame Brown, myself, Obsidian, Kevin Samuels, Mr. Jack, all these people y'all hear me talking about Red Supreme. All of us talking the way we talking, giving y'all these jewels. You hear me? Real men. It's time for us to have our voice and to shut all this weak ass shit going on down. God damn it. Cooking they ass, man. I love what I'm hearing from Kwame Brown, man. It made me feel good. I'm about to go, I'm about to move, y'all. I'm about to move into my new crib. I ain't rich, I'm poor as anybody else out here, man. You hear me? This is doing, bro. Do while I'm driving. Nah, but for real, though, Kwame Brown, keep doing what you're doing, bro. I'm one of them type of guys, I ain't gonna tell you to tone it down. You shouldn't do that. Maybe you should say it. Nah, nigga, do exactly what the fuck you doing, bruh. In the way you do it. Don't change up shit. Nigga, you sitting on 20, 30 acres. Fuck what these fuck niggas talking about, man. I respect what you doing, bruh. This ain't cow texting. This is real recognizing real. I'm a real nigga like you a real nigga. And we don't take offense in that word, nigga. Cause we, yeah. We are real men. You hear me? And all y'all, Charlemagne the Frog, all y'all people, I done addressed all these I done been telling y'all about these people since I've been home. Oh, yeah, I came home from prison in 2006. I've been telling y'all about these people since I've been home. If anybody know me, recognize me if you're from Columbus, Ohio, you know me. I've been telling y'all about this shit since I've been home. The chickens are here to roost. God damn it. The chickens have come home to roost. And we about to fry y'all's asses up. www.arealtalkmedia.com Abril Talk me, uh, Podcast on YouTube. Subscribe, like, share, and comment. Motherfucker. Art Media LLC at yahoo.com. Send me an email. Come on the podcast. We coming for y'all. 2021, the year of accountability. 2020 was this year of exposure. 2021 gonna be the year of accountability. We about to start cooking you motherfuckers, man. Stack with the facts, man, signing off. Hey, yeah.